Oh, dog. Today's Christmas Eve. Oh, great. I hate Christmas. Oh. Well, might as well just get ready for school. I guess I look alright. Time to go. Mm. Is it morning already? What day is it even today? Well, I better check the calendar. Oh, dog, it's Christmas Eve. Great. I hate Christmas. <sighs> Might as well just get ready for school, I guess. Hmm, what should I wear? I think I'll wear you two today. Already. Hmm. I guess I look alright. Well, time for breakfast. Hmm. Morning, Mom. Good morning, Dad. Good morning, sweetheart. Oh, good morning, honey. Breakfast is nearly ready. Morning, sissy. Oh, good morning, Camila. So, what's for breakfast? Well, since it's Christmas Eve, it's something special. Uh, can you stop saying Christmas Eve? Can it just be like any other normal day? Honey, why do you hate Christmas so much? No, Christmas is a great day. It was when Jesus was born. Uh, Dad, I have my reasons, alright? Alright then, whatever. All right, here you guys go. I got you some salads. Here you go, honey. And you. And of course, for Camila. Seriously, mom? Salad? That This is your special meal? I was thinking maybe something more special than this. Oh, come on, honey. It's not that bad. Mom, it, it, it is. Ew, green stuff. Eh, I'm not eating this. It's it's just green. Eh, I hate green things. Oh, come on, kids. Just enjoy your meal and be thankful. At least you have food to eat, okay? Not like some other people out there that are poor and they don't even have food to eat. Fine, whatever. <laughs> that was horrible. Hey, I'm not eating this. Ew. Camila, how dare you throw your food on the ground? That is not good. Uh, come on. Let's go. I'll take you something else. Yay. Well, that's unfair. Come on, honey. She's just six, all right? Give her a break. Fine. I'm done. I'm going to school now. Alright. Bye. Bye. Mwah. Love you. I'll see you after school. Okay. Tell mom I said goodbye. Alright. Thanks for that. Bye. I know, right? Um, excuse me, coming through. Oh, sorry. Excuse me, you're kind of blocking my locker. <sighs> sorry, loser. <sighs> loser. <laughs> hey. Hi, Carmen. Hi. How's it been going? Everything was great, I guess. 
So, are you excited for Christmas tomorrow? <sighs> no. Why? Why do you hate Christmas so much? I mean, what has Christmas ever done to you that you hate it so much? No. I have no stories, okay? Okay. Oh, whatever. I better get to class. Yeah, soon. I'll see you later. Bye. Bye. Long day school. I know, right? Well, I better get home now. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you on Monday. Alright, bye. Bye, Merry Christmas. Um, can you stop saying that? I'm sorry. Well, uh, happy holidays, guys. Bye. Bye. Mom, I'm back. Oh, hi, honey. How was school today? It was like usual. All right. Well, tomorrow your aunt and your uncle and all your cousins are coming, including grandma and grandpa. Oh, great. Honey, why do you hate Christmas so much? Hey, go on, you can tell me. Look, mom, I'm really not feeling of talking right now, okay? Honey, I just wanna know. Can, from you were 12, you've hated Christmas ever since then. What did Christmas do to you? I remember back when you were so young, you used to love Christmas, you were excited to open presents, and you would tell amazing stories about Santa Claus. But what happened? Where is that little happy girl on Christmas? Mom, that happy girl is gone. She's not here anymore. She has grown up. She's got, she has had enough of Christmas, okay? Something bad happened to her, and that's why she hates Christmas so much. Now, if you excuse me, I'm going to go to my room. Good day. <sighs> Carmen, why? Why do you have to do this to us? Sissy? Sissy, come here! Sissy! Sissy! Uh, what do you want, Camila? Come here, I want to show you something. What is it? Just come. Fine. Better be important. It surely is. Come on. Look, sis, my favorite Christmas show is on. Seriously? This is all you want to show me? Yeah? <sighs> Camila, how many times? When will you grow up? I've told you, like, so many times. Santa Claus isn't real. He's fake. He's just a rumor. He's not real. Well then, where does the presents come from? It's clearly from him. No, it's not. It's all from mom and dad. They buy it and from us knowing. So, then they put it under you know, the tree. And then they just assume. They just said that it's Santa Claus. But really, it's not, okay? What about the cookies and milk? Who drank and eat those? That was mom and dad too, so that you would believe that Santa Claus. Really? Yeah, really. That's why I hate Christmas. Because of that. Because Santa Claus not Santa Claus is not real? Yes, let me tell you a little story, okay? Okay. When I was a little kid like you, I used to love Christmas so much the Christmas tree and put my very best effort. I would give to Santa cookies and milk, even sometimes a cake. I was so happy. You know, I became a good girl. I, I obeyed mom and everything. So, you know, everything was perfect. I thought Santa loved me. Of course, I would get presents and everything, and I would always believe that it was Santa. But, but one day, I saw mom and dad putting the presents under the Christmas tree. Mommy? Daddy? Oh, um, Carmen, what are you doing awake? I thought you were sleeping. I can't sleep. What are you guys doing? Um, nothing. These were presents from Santa. Yeah, yeah. He, he wanted us to put it under the Christmas tree for you. Oh, really? Are you sure that it's not from you? 
What? No, it's from Santa. Yeah. And wait a second. I know. So you've been lying to me for all these years? What do you mean lie? We've never lied to you, sweetheart. We love you. Why would we lie to you? Then why are you trying carrying presents and slowly going to the Christmas tree and putting it under them? So from all these times, the person has been eating all those cookies and milk and putting presents under my tree were you both? What? No. Why would be yes? Of course it's Santa Claus. Yeah. Stop lying. I know it's you. I can't believe it. I've been believing in this, this whole fake lie. I'm going to my room. So from that day and on, I never liked Christmas. And, you know, because I I just thought that Santa Claus really existed. I was dreaming of working with him and, you know, meeting him one day, but it was all just fake. I was so heartbroken. It really affected me so much. And then I never liked Christmas. As you can tell, that's why I hate Christmas. Oh, wow. That must be hard for you, of course. Thanks, sis, for telling me. I should have known. I guess no more giving cookies and cream to Santa. Well, you know, he can always do that, but if you do that even, his mom and dad is going to be eating it. Alright, well, I'm going to my room now. Bye. Bye. You know what? Even I don't like Christmas, too. Christmas is fake. I hate Christmas. <sighs> I'm gonna go and have a little nap. Dear Carmen, I know you hate Christmas because of me, and I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything that I've done. I know that I ruined your childhood. I'm very sorry, Carmen. You should know that every day on Christmas Eve, I actually go to your house. I leave you presents under the Christmas tree, and I also eat your cookies and milk, and thanks for the cake. It's really delicious. But you should know, when your parents, that day when your parents gave you those presents, it was a gift from them, not from me, but from them. I gave you another gift. I told your mommy and daddy to give you presents because you've become such a good girl. And don't worry, I will give you a big present this year, considering you've been such a great girl. But, of course, you wouldn't really believe that I exist. And I know you might just be thinking, this is all just crazy, I'm dreaming, but you should know that it's just a message from me, Santa Claus. Goodbye. Ugh. What did I just dream about? Was it really Santa Claus? Could it be? No, Carmen, you're just hallucinating. It's just a dream, it's not like it's real. <sighs> well, I might as well just straight up go to bed because it's already night. Hmm. It's already morning. Great, it's Christmas. Well, better go down the stairs and open the presents at least. At least I get something. Mommy, Daddy! Good morning, Camilla. Look what Santa left for you. Some presents. Are you sure it's not you both? Because Carmen told me that you both were the one who gave us his presents. What? No. We just gave you these. But look, there's a large present right there. I'm not sure who is it from. But it says it's for Carmen. Good morning, Mom. Good morning, Dad. Good morning, Camila. Good morning, sweetheart. Are you excited for Christmas today? Oh, not really. Oh, honey. Just, why don't we just open up the presents? Fine. 
So who wants to go first? Why not you, Carmen? Here, you can open this. There's like this large gift. We're not sure who's it from. The large gift. Carmen, I always give you the large gifts. Could it be from Santa Claus? <sighs> no. Who is this from? I'm not sure. Why don't you check on the back? Yeah, maybe there's a name on it? Oh, okay. What is this? Look, I got a note. Why not you read it? Yeah, let's see who's it from. Dear Carmen, I am very sorry that, I, that I've been ruining your childhood, but I'm actually here. And here's a big gift for me to you. I just want always what you've been wanting. Sorry I didn't give it to you, but I chose the right time, and that is now. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, Carmen. From Santa Claus. Who so? Who's it from? It said it's from Santa Claus. Oh, really? Let me take a look. Oh, it is. But I thought Santa Claus isn't real. Oh, honey, whoever told you that? Carmen? Uh, Carmen, don't ruin your little sister's childhood. Honey, Santa Claus does exist. Then what is this large present then? Oh, I can't wait. Why don't you open it? Um, okay. Oh, my dog. It's the necklace and the flower that I wanted for my birthday. Oh, look. Wow. Well, lucky you. Wow, it's so sparkly. Don't touch it, Camilla. Go. Sorry. It's from Santa Claus. Really? Mom, Dad, are you sure this is not one of your jokes again? Honey, we didn't give that to you. This is our present from you. It's this tiny thing. <sighs> oh, Mom, Dad, how do I look? Oh, honey, you look beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, you're so lucky. Thanks. <laughs> Dear Diary, I got a present from Santa, and this time I think it's real, because even I had a dream about him, and you won't believe what he gave me, things that I've been wanting ever since I was 13. I can't believe it, I finally got him. I really feel horrible that I didn't believe in him, I should have believed in him. Well, guess what, now I'm starting to like, I'm starting to like Christmas again. Well, my family member's gonna come soon, so uh, I better stop here. So, I'll write later. Cartman, Isabel and Lena is here. Oh, I'm coming, Mom. Time to go. Wherever you are, Santa Claus, thank you so much. You really made my Christmas this year.